What is up everybody? It's Eric with Classic Cards here. We have another, yes, another. You guys are amazing. You just keep surprising me. The surprises are never ending. Another postal procession, AKA Mail Day. And this one is all the way from Japan. Clint San himself, none other than Swing Away Sports Cards. Super excited once I saw this because I knew this package had traveled a long, long ways. And I know he's a very thoughtful individual here in this card community. My guy Clint. So let's see what he sent. And he is from around the Sacramento area too. So not only does he live in Japan, but he has roots close to home as well. We have some directions here. We have a package that says last, we'll put that up to the top. We have some packs as well. 87 Donrux, 2020 tops opening day. How about that? And what looks to be a ton Oh, 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 uh oh, a ton of Angels PC cards. This is incredible. Okay. Oh, 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 and because we have actually talked about this before, look at this a Calbi pack of Japanese cards. And I believe the Calbi is the uh, chip company. So this is similar to, I don't know, what would be like an Utz chip. I'm guessing. So we're gonna have to put that out to the side and get into those, but how about this stack of stacks that Clint has sent us? I don't even know where to start. So I'm just gonna take it from the top and go from there. Holy moly. This with, with so much stuff that this is, you must have been uh, building this for quite some time. So Clint, you know I appreciate you, man. and. You are the man. Everybody check him out. I'm gonna have his, the link to his channel down below. Again, swing away sports cards. Clint, these fortune tellers are so cool. Such a weird shape to it. Very, very cool. How about a Mike Trout? No, this is not, this is all Trout. Oh boy, love it, love it. You guys know who Trout is. We got opening day. All-Star Game, one of his beautiful catches there. Donruss Optic, he's mountain climbing. Two peak performers. Nice etching there, it's a sweet card. From Bowman, huge, he's huge. In 2020 Bowman, how about that? I always love this card, like a trout. No, Donnie driving up is on the back, like, where are you taking me? <laughs> <laughs> and then we get Trouty, uh, Tani, and the Fletch man, Fletcher himself. Memorable moments from 2012, his greatest rookie season. Yes, yes, love it. 2018 Trouty. Whoo, a nice, this is, has a yellow back, I think. Yes, the 2012 style, 2012 lookalike with Tori Hunter, Mark Trumbo. And if you think about it, Trout's already played with some legends. The 2020. Spring has sprung. He's just waiting to get out there in the batting cages. Oh, we got some sneaky Adele. Look at that. Sporting news from the Heritage Miners, right? Very cool. That is a sweet card. Have to add that to the Adele PC. And some other guys are at PC. We got Ryan, Carew, Calhoun, Green. Another Rod Carew, Mr. Newhart himself, got an 83 and then an 83 All-Star card. And what, what is this? We got numbered cards. Is this a Mother's Day Pujols? No way. 10 out of 50. Look at that, Mom. My mom likes Pujols. Red, pink, parallel. And a Simba green chrome out of 99. 58 out of 99. This is so cool. It almost feels like it's full circle 
because in a Chrome break with us here that we had months and months and months ago, we pulled for Clint the Green Wave Tatis Chrome Rookie, number to 99, which is just so cool. Might be probably the biggest card that we pulled on this channel ever, right? And we pulled a gold Jeter now and a gold Tatis base. But that's 99, only 99 for the Green Wave Tatis rookie. I don't know, in my opinion, that is, that is up there. So holy cow, Clint. These are some sweet cards. We got more trout. Look at that, an orange parallel. I'm gonna have a field day putting these guys where they're my trout binders. Ascension is from Chronicles now. Phoenix, again, Chronicles, that's a cool one. Like the Phoenix, like a chrome, Panini chrome. Look at that. We have the base. Uh, this is unparalleled. And then the Astral. Shoo! And in the uh, 2020 Chronicles, I pulled a numbered one of these that was Trout. So this is just, that's cool. We're going to have to put those on the board. Those are shiny. Beautiful. Score Trout. Never even seen that one. That's beautiful. Optic. Woo! Another optic or prism instant impact. Yeah, that's for sure. Man, dude, does Panini make some cool cards? And a Gypsy Queen. Holy moly. Wow, this stack feels thick. Big and heavy. Fill this fill this guy up here. What do we got? Vladdy Daddy, the family business. It's funny because I have a chrome Vladdy Jr. one of these. That's cool. Look at that, old Vladdy Carrera with his old facial hair, that hair, he's kind of getting older. Holy cow, I didn't have any of these Vladdy cards. Look at that, and what? He's sending us a Buster Posey. This is one of Clint's favorite players, Buster Posey. That is simply amazing. I pretty much set all my Buster Posey's aside for you. <laughs> And how about that? We got more guys IPC, the big boys like Mark McGuire, Frank Tomas, Big Hurt. We got some Turkey Reds, Vladdy Daddy, Guerrero. Uh, you even sent me some of the sillier PCs that I do, like the mascots, Mr. Red, Mr. Met, TC Bear, Pirate Parrot. I like, know I didn't have those guys. <laughs> Love it. Oh, and maybe the reason why these were heavy, we got some gold too, Dan Plesek. And if you could say the card, it's yours. Archimedes Caminero. Gold, 1829. So thank you for some gold, Clint. And this is why they were so heavy. Holy cow, we got some coins. Old Scherzer Cyborg. And Josh Bell, what they call a commemorative coin. Super, super cool. Series two, I didn't open too much of that, so probably only have one or two of these guys, but no Scherzer, Josh Bell. I know that, super thick and heavy. Like those a lot. Very cool. What do we got here? We got some Otani. No, it's Showtime, baby. That would be a name variation. There he is again in 2020, and a yellow parallel. I swear, when you guys send cards, it's like you look in my binders, figure out what I don't have, and you're like, yeah, okay, that is what I'm saying. <laughs> like this stuff, Rookies and Stars, Season Ticket Otani, Season Ticket Chrome. Wait, they, they had a Contender's Optic? Where have I been? That is cool, beautiful. I always like the etching that Panini puts on there. We got a Gypsy Queen Shohei, opening day Shohei, a Chrome, Bowman Chrome, Shohei. See, I feel like I, I know Shohei's cards and I don't, I don't think I have a Bowman Chrome like that. Nice, and <laughs> numbers games, you know what I mean? That's pretty cool. 286 was his batting average forever, not counting 2020, like when he came from Japan, he batted 286 in Japan, came over to America and MLB batted 286. <laughs> Um, he's just uh, an athlete. Otani Stadium Club in the dugout. We got some Donruss and then the Optic. And then the Mythical Optic. That one's a cool one. 
Very cool. I haven't seen that design before. Alan and Ginter Otani, you look like a nice boy. Some big league designated hitter slash pitcher. When have you seen that? I can tell you it's not too often. Shohei Otani and we have the Bash and the Burn Otani. I thought they would, I was totally expecting me to, to flip it around. This card is super cool, but come on, it's Otani. You got the Bash, right? He's hitting and they shouldn't have put a pitching, him pitching, burn like a fastball. Anyway, Tops, you can contact me uh, through my agent. Uh, <laughs> this is, this is a, you can tell it's a whole lot of fun for me right now, Clint. I appreciate it and it's gonna be a lot of fun. Putting these, organizing these. This sticker, is, it's gotta be an upper deck sticker, but I don't know where it's from. Love that, I do collect stuff like this. Look at how vibrant that hologram is Woo! super cool and we got some okay well i just off the back these are one of my favorite medallions that they've ever put in blaster boxes these rookie card medallions where they have the person's rookie card or close to it and the they place a rookie card there that's super cool this one's sandy almar jr i like those a lot so along the same vein as the coin but cooler a lot lighter too <laughs> and what do we have here some top loaded cards and a rod carew 83 rod carew 319 batting average mike witt 351 the ra of course batting and pitching leaders back then for the team so i feel like our pitching has always needed some help but not too shabby mike trout looking back is this a 2013 pinnacle insert it is a 2013. I've never seen a looking back insert ever of anybody. I wonder if these are like super hard to pull or something. That is awesome. Mike Trout, of course. Big catch right there. Big catch. Trouty card number 100 in series one. We got, who we got here? Albert Pujols. Point to the sky. First baseman. They call this a calling card. Also never seen this before. It looks, feels like a... Uh, interesting insert here calling card from 2013 almost has like a like a museum collection feel to it like it Ooh, what is this Griffin Canning rookie what are you what are you doing to me Clint you're gonna make me cry Griffin Canning rookie red angel red number to 10 holy cow it's, it gives it his best game too it was May 18th 2019 that is pretty sweet. UCLA guy here. So California. Ty Buttry gold. Auto. We know the golds are numbered to 50 around here. Number 11 of 50. On card. Gold auto. Oh my gosh. It's Crone. CJ Crone. Numbered 86 of 199. Relic auto from Bowman Platinum. 2014 Bowman Platinum. CJ Crone was a beast. He hit 30 home runs for, who was it, the Rays? They DFA'd him. He hit 30 home runs for the Twins. They DFA'd him. Hopefully his time on the Tigers will be different. How about that? Some crazy autos, some parallels. And, and as, do you want me to open this last? That's supposed to be bigger stuff? You're scaring me. You're scaring me. How about some managers? Angel managers. Look at that. Mike Sosha. Gene Mock. Mach. Mooch. I've never heard of these guys. That's because they're older than me. So part of this is cards. You can look. He was the, uh, you know, he was the manager. Okay, what was the team? Boom, right there. Love it. Oh, six Mike Sosha. We got Wally Joyner. Fleer Limited Edition. I feel like these Fleer Limited always had some kind of like a holiday kind of vibe to them. A nice Wally Joyner. More Wally Joyner. Tory Hunter 2010 Bone or Tops Chrome. Hunter was a beast, that's for sure. Dick Schofield rated rookie. Sean Rodriguez rookie card. What happened to you, Sean? Oh, Francisco Rodriguez K Rod, who. One of the big reasons why we were able to secure the World Series <laughs> in 2002, <coughs> sorry, Clint, to your <laughs> Giants. <laughs> Wally Joyner, again, I always, 
I always give him a hard time for that 2002 World Series, of course, because like I said, he's a Posey fan, Giants fan, and the Angels beat the Giants. Fleer Hall of Famer. Is this one of those uh, rack pack insert things? Don Sutton. See, Angels had a lot of Hall of Famers. Uh, they just didn't end up being a Hall of Famer on the Angels. <laughs> Floyd Bannister, Fred Lynn. He was good. Look at that, 83 with Boone there, like I had him and the Mariners guy are both looking at this guy. And he, he's like, oh, I could catch it, I'm gonna get him out. And this guy's like, oh man, he could catch it, I might be out. <laughs> Don Baylor, we got some old guys here. Donnie Hill, Kent Anderson, see like, I don't even know he, who he is, but now I do. Greg Minton, Doug DeCinces playing basketball. And his little shot there. <laughs> I love the oldies, cause he could watch modern baseball, but it's not really, uh, you know, too much to. You can't you can't go back and and learn about things by watching it. Really, they don't have you know 1987 every game of the season. So cards are one way that I learn. And is this? No way. This is just a stack of gold cards. You know, as I like to put together top gold sets. And how about the Zimmerman, Gonzalez, old Justin Turner, Randall Gritchick, all gold parallels. Holy moly. Oh, even a Dodgers gold team card. That's pretty cool. I have very, very rarely, very rarely do I see gold team cards. Polanco, Greg Holland, this guy who nobody knows, D. Gordon, who's D. Strange Gordon now. Holy cow, another Ryu. Look at that. We got multiple gold. 2018, 2020. John Jaso. Where did he go? Kevin Jepson, who was on the Angels at one point. John Axford. Christopher Negron. Andre Ethier, of course. Long time right fielder for the Dodgers. We got some gold draft picks. Gold 93s. Thank you so much, my man. No, I put those stuff together. Joe Blanton, he was also on the Angels at one point. Eric Campbell, Eric C. Dustin Ackley, I love these gold sparkle foils. Roger Salkeld, gold leaf rookie. And an orange, Raul Ibanez. That's orange is number 223 out of 250. Good old Raul Ibanez. He had a long career, Ibanez did. Of course, I remember him most on the Mariners because they played the Angels a lot. Holy cow, Clint. Hope you guys enjoyed that, but we're not done yet. Let's open some packs. Let's do the 2020, the Don Rust, and then we'll open this Japanese, the Japan Calibi pack. So this is 2020 opening day. We got Jeff McHitz, the Flying Squirrel McNeil. Hunter Dozier, how about the Gavin Lux? Opening day rookie. That's a nice one. I still think Luxie is going to be a nice asset for the Dodgers. So that is a cool card. Giolito, Eloy Jimenez himself, and Lux's new teammate, Sticker Collection Bets. Mookie Bets. Sticker Collection is pretty cool for getting a sticker and not having to buy the sticker collection. <laughs> Very cool. How about 1987 Don Russ pack? Straight from Clint himself. Clint the man. The myth, the legend. We have a Roberto Clemente puzzle piece. Love the puzzles. 87 Don Russ. Love the design. Of course, guys like old Barry Bonds, Bo Jackson, Big Mac rookies. We got a trout! No relation. Rick Dempsey, Mitch Webster, shout out to Kevin's card breaks. Old D Gooden, Dwight Gooden, Kruko and Valle. We love old 87 Donruss. Opening up a pack of baseball cards older than I from the 80s is super cool thank you Clint and how about something you know I have never done before we have a 
Japanese pack here. Or two packs. I don't know how this works. What do we got? Two packs? Calbi. I don't know how to open it. I don't want to break it. Okay, they're just stuck together. All right. All right. Okay. So these are special specialty packs, I guess. It's come literally attached to the chip bag or whatever. <laughs> you can totally tell. And here it is. So if you guys can read Japan, there it is. Tell me what it says. Now I know. I'm expecting this to be some kind of baseball player, right? Eh? And indeed it is, and they are super cool. Something that we don't get here. This type of like, I don't know what you call this. Pix pixel hollow foil, pixel foil. That is cool. Very, very cool. Samurai Japan. It's like a Sar Saruharu O. No, I don't know. Who, I don't know who that is. It looks like we got a checklist on the back. Samurai Japan is 2019 Calbi officially licensed product. Samurai Japan. Look at that. A little gold facsimile auto there. That is super cool. We're not done yet because we have a second pack. That's right. I'm going to open it right now. What do we have? What do we got? Saw the checklist on the back. Who did we get? Wow, these have different foils. I mean, come on, tops. Step on your game. What, like, how do they do that? Look at, woo! It's like he's on fire. Woo! Look at that. That is super cool. Samurai, Japan, and uh, you're gonna have to tell me who these guys are. This guy doesn't have a facsimile auto. This guy's got the gold shiny. Very cool. So this is the checklist, and this is this guy. Um, I guess those are his 2018 stats there. So pretty cool, pretty cool. Can't read any of it, but that is just awesome. To open up a baseball card pack from Japan, awesome. And now, we're following directions last but not least. From Clint Swing Away Sports Cards, the man himself, we have a David Fletcher with some other good stuff here. Of course, you guys know David Fletcher is my man. D Fletch. Nice good old Fletcher here. We have a Swing Away Sports Card Auto. One of one. <laughs> with the security guy. I'm gonna put this in a special place. And to finish it all off, Topps Archives Signature Series. Look at that, the good old Angel's Closer. Troy Percival, I was actually talking about Percival today with my dad. That's crazy. Number 30 out of 53. That is cool, good old like 1960 design. Of course, he was on the Rays this time, which was, what, 2008? Whew! Troy Percival. That is awesome. On card. They give it a little archive stamp right there. Well, Clint, you have literally sent everything possible that you could. You sent Angels cards. You sent the uh, inserts, gold. You gave us the relics here, packs. Uh, we got we got rookies and the packs. Gavin Luck we got autos, relics, packs from Japan. Dude, I can't thank you enough. And again, everybody, if you have not check out his channel, he used to do a lot of subscription box videos and stuff before he had to move and kind of tone that down. But I'm sure. He'll get back to all those subscription things one day. As always, keep collecting, care for the cards, most importantly, care for each other because you guys see how awesome this card community is. It is about the community. Yes, each and every one of you 
just as much as it is about the cards and sharing them together, cards with the community, makes this hobby the best. So we'll catch you next time. See you guys later.